Good morning, everybody. It's Super Bowl Sunday, February 13th. And it appears as if we won't be watching any Super Bowl. We'll be out plowing. So as you can tell, I'm not even ready. So it's time to get the truck ready. I gotta put this plow on this truck. Now, just a quick update, guys. I took the truck in um, to the shop after the last snowstorm because it had a power steering pump issue. And long story short, they can't figure out what's going on with it. The steering is fine sometimes and then in intermittently it loses power steering for a quick second and then it comes back. So they told me to drive it. There could be air in the line. I'm not sure. Um, I think it's going to need a pump down the line, but I don't know. The mechanic can't seem to figure out what's going on with it. We got some damage from the last storm. I don't know if you guys can see this on camera. There's a big crease here in this rear quarter panel. I got some dents in the door. This is kind of caved in a little bit from when it fell in the ditch. So I'm not too happy about that, but I guess it is what it is. It's a work truck. So we're going to get this plow mounted on the truck, and then we're going to run to Lowe's and grab some sand. Um, to put in the back for weight. I think I need more weight in the back. I initially thought the dump insert was going to be enough weight uh, to weigh the rear end of the truck down, but uh, to get more weight over the rear axle, but I guess not. So we're going to get the plow on. We're going to run the lows and get the, the sand and uh, start plowing. Let's see if I can get this in on the first shot. Probably not, but we'll see. Uh, pretty close to lined up. Let's see if I can get it in there. side too I always check because one time I thought this was in all the way and on this side it was out a little bit and the half the plow fell off on the way to the gas station so I'm like well won't do that again always double check yeah, let's test this thing out see if it works Okay, we're in business. <laughs> Go ahead, let's see it. Well, I, <sighs> I gotta get it in the way back somehow. That ain't gonna happen. Use your strength. I can't, I'm gonna hurt myself. <laughs> <laughs> All right, go ahead. <sighs> I don't even think I can do it. <sighs> we should have taken the llama all past that. All right, time for bed. Time for bed. All right, so I got basically no power steering in this truck. Let's roll out the serpentine belt. I'm gonna put some belt dressing on it and see what happens. 
I doubt it's that. I think the pump's junk, but I guess I gotta be my own advocate. Alright, hopefully that does it. Probably not, but it's worth a shot. Alright, so just as I expected, the uh, belt dressing did nothing. It didn't work. So I'm suspecting it's a pump, but you know what? We're just going to ride with it through the storm. Hopefully everything works out and the truck doesn't break down. But we're going to eventually have to put a pump in it. I should have just put a pump in it before the snow, but the mechanic said it could have air in it. Um, he didn't think it was the pump, but it's definitely the pump. So hopefully we make it through the storm without any problems and uh, we're going to have you guys with us. So if we do have a problem, you're going to see it. All right, so obviously there's a problem with the truck. It's leaking. Um, power steering fluid all over my driveway and there's barely any power steering fluid so I have my cousin Kevin here trying to figure out what's going on he's really smart when it comes to this stuff So we're still trying to figure out what's going on. There's a lot of fluid coming from somewhere. Um, it doesn't help that everything's wet from driving the truck around. But I know Kevin will figure it out. All right, so Kevin found the leak. It's coming from the pump itself. The bearing is wiped out. And it's leaking from the seal. So now we gotta put a power steering pump in the truck. Um, are you able to see it spray from the bottom? You can see it spray up top. Really? All right, guys, so my truck's still broken. Um, so my buddy Steve came through again. He's going to let me borrow his truck. The guy is a huge lifesaver. Um, it's a Ford F-250. It's a 2009. Uh, we got about five inches of snow. Enough to do, to do one pass. That's about all we're going to get in. We just finished watching the Super Bowl. It was a great game. And now it's time to go to work. All right. Let's do it. I'm just a shoveler tonight, so you're in charge of that list right there. 
Well, we got 30 driveways to knock out, so let's do it. 31. 31 driveways. I stand correct. All right, guys, 10.21 p.m. Sunday night. 31 driveways to knock out. Got about five inches of snow. Not bad. Should be able to knock them out quick. All right. First property of the night. Should be an easy one. I think I'm just gonna back blade in front of the doors and then uh, turn the truck around and push the snow across the street. I think that's the best attack method on this one. I don't want to back blade the whole thing because uh, it just make a mess. <sighs> this plow doesn't have the back blade attachment on it, so it's not going to do as good as my stainless one. But hey, get the job done. And that's all that matters. So Renee's just shoveling the snow away from the garage doors for me. She's um, putting the snow underneath the plow. And I'm just backblading it away from the doors. It's nice to have a second set of eyes. So we don't crash into anything. We don't want that. It's nice to drive a truck with power steering. <laughs> I thought I was gonna have Popeye forearms if I had to go out plowing in mine. That go right there, hon? Let's go right there. Okay. 
I wish all these driveways were this easy. That never happens. Looks nice. What's that noise this thing's making? Something rattling under here. Mm -hmm. like something's rattling under here. It's annoying. Is it the muffler? Is it the muffler? Sound like it. It's, it's annoying. Sounds like it's falling off. A typical New England truck, rotting away. Ugh. Got the big shovel. Look at this bad boy. in front of the mailbox. I should do it.
All right, so we've been plowing for a little while now. Renee, how many driveways have we gotten done so far? Mm, maybe 20. So we've done about 20 driveways. It's now 3.12 in the morning. Mm -hmm. And what do we have, uh, 11 left? I think so, something like that. So hopefully we can bang this, these 11 out quickly so we can go home and get some shot eye. Right now we are in uh, Attleboro, Massachusetts. <clears throat> if you can turn the wiper blades off. Yeah. What is that? Oh no.
so we're in the home stretch now it's uh let's see 506 in the morning I'm starting to get pretty tired now just want this night to be over go home and get some sleep I think we got like five or six driveways left Renee's starting to get tired too so we're just trying to muscle it out let's keep it going this is when it can get dangerous when you get tired so gotta try to stick with it and stay alert Renee's talking to a customer I'm surprised she's up So Renee's gonna finish uh, shoveling this one. The pathway behind the car and get uh, a little bit of snow off the steps and then uh, we're on to the next one. A lip. I'll get out and shovel after.
pretty good right there. Do one more pass and up the middle and that'll be that. We're in the home stretch now. Oh, it's been a long night. All right guys, well, 31 driveways done, finally. Truck did well, everybody's safe, everybody's healthy. Truck's not damaged. Nope. Renee's happy to be home. <laughs> yes I am. My coffee? Yeah. So, we're gonna go in, we're gonna rinse off and get some shot eye. If you guys are digging our videos, please like, share, and subscribe. We greatly appreciate that. And if there's anything that you guys want to see, such as any any type of lawn care related footage, uh, please drop us a line in the comment section below. We'll be glad to shoot it for you. Well, guys, thanks for tuning in. Renee, you want any last words for the viewers? Yes, for some out-of-state viewers that don't know what rinsing off means, because I don't even know what that means. My husband says I'm going to rinse off. I'm going to go take a shower. Oh, okay. <laughs> All right. But yeah. anyways, no, I have I have no other final closing words today other than I'm I'm glad to be home. Yeah, me too. Gonna well, go, we're going to go take a warm shower. Yeah, we're going to go take a nice warm we'll shower, eat something, relax, and get some shut eye. All right, guys, we'll see you on the next video. Thanks. Bye.